We're here to compare Digium phones with the competition on Asterisk Now. Okay, I've configured an extension on Asterisk Now. Now to boot my Digium phone. There's the Asterisk Now server. There's my extension. That was fast. Time for a latte. Okay, I've configured an extension on Asterisk Now. Now to boot my phone. Enter my username and password. Okay, enter my username and password correctly. After saving your configuration, you'll wait up to two minutes for your phone to register. Remember, you must repeat this process for every phone. Repeat this process for what? You have got to be kidding me. Time to populate my contacts into my Digium phone. Awesome, my contacts are auto-populated and they'll auto-update. Time to populate my contacts into my phone. Okay, let's see. I guess I'll enter them manually. There goes lunch. Now to check my visual voicemail. I love these easy access buttons for listening to, deleting, forwarding the voicemail, and more. Now to check my old school audio only voicemail. This is as outdated as a flip phone. I need to park this call so I can pick it up in the conference room. I'll just press park. There's my extension. I need to park this call so I can pick it up in the conference room. I need a call park extension? Oh yeah, they told me what that extension was. Now I just need to remember the parking lot number. I hope that worked. I'll check my call queue. On queue, I can see if I'm logged in or not and how many callers I have waiting. There's my one-click soft keys for logging in and out of the queue and for pausing in case I need to take a breather. I'll check my call queue. That's right, this phone doesn't have a queue. Why do we buy this phone again? The results are in. Digium phones with Asterisk Now simplify your life.